My pathway began many years ago when I started working at Life Beyond at Australia, initially in administration, and then I moved into marketing and media and uh, several other roles before becoming general manager of the organisation. Uh, I left not long after that when I was expecting my first child and uh, went on to form an ad agency with two of the uh, former directors of Life Be In It and working on government projects for community service campaigns, so cyclones, bushfires, uh, any sort of natural disaster. I've worked on the literacy campaign and I've worked with government quite a bit over the years. Uh, I've also, I also had a long stint in, in finance working as a consultant uh, before coming into Melbourne Victory about five and a half years ago. I didn't understand early on in my career that my real passion was for what sport could do for people. It wasn't so much how people could get involved in sport, it was really what sport can do. And the work that I do at Victory, really, it's really a privilege actually to be able to do what I do. Um, I lead a team that has a, an enormous community, uh, sorry, enormous range of community programs. And we do work from Parkville Youth Detention Centre uh, into conservative communities with girls who would never ever get to experience football otherwise. Um, there's all sorts of things that we can do with sport and that's what I love about it. And I love the opportunities that um, are still available uh, and the opportunities for women that will exist uh, even more so now with, this, with the Change Our Game campaign. Just recently, when the government announced that they would invest $10 million into what will become the home of our W League team, it will also be the Youth Academy for Melbourne Victory. But for our women's team, it's been two years of long hard work to actually get this funding for this facility. They will now have a home where they can train, they can play, and they will have access to the multi-million dollar sports science facility at VU, which is absolutely fantastic. So that's my career highlight so far. Still got plenty to go, but that's my career highlight so far. To be a Change Our Game ambassador really means an opportunity. For, for years now, I've seen men administer sport, and I come at this from a very different angle to the athletes. I, I see what the men get, and I see what the women get, but I also see in community sport what young girls are missing out on. You know, I, I have two children, I have a son and a daughter. It would never occur to me to ask either one to go outside to get changed. That's what's gone on in previous years for girls. So any opportunity I get to promote women, to encourage leadership for women, and at the community, at the grassroots level, um, you know, I've experienced the, the 100 men in the room and me. So I'd really like to see women step up into those leadership roles. And I'd like to see men give them the opportunity to do that, to really become champions of change in their own clubs.